Can anybody hear me? Is anybody there? Ken? Lando? Chewy? Well, I guess no one will. I see BB-8, but I guess he can't hear me. Hello, welcome to another episode of Everything Star Wars. I'm your host, Rob. What's going on? If you're new to the channel, please subscribe down below to see future Star Wars content. Well, today I'm on the Millennium Falcon. Well, not me per se, but trying to communicate and I cannot find anybody. But I found you and you found me. So let's talk about Solo, a Star Wars movie. So this weekend was, uh, oh, there he goes. Bobby Beard. This weekend was, just make sure no one's here. Okay, no troopers, so I'm good. This weekend was a uh, solo Star Wars movie release, and it released on Friday, May 25th. It made 103 million for the four days. Now, a lot of people said, well, it bombed. I got news for you. For a heist movie, besides Rogue One, it made the most money. It beat Ocean's 11, 12, 13, Ant-Man, just to name a few movies. So I don't think that's bombing, but maybe for Disney standards, it has. Now, we all don't know how much Kathleen Kennedy spent on this movie, it's estimated that the budget was $250 million. So they made 103 and it cost 250 But, you know, it's only out four days. Now, the other thing is, before Lucasfilm, you know, before the 35 years before Disney bought, the Star Wars franchise. It made four billion in ticket sales and forty billion dollars in merchandise sales. So most of the sales didn't come from the movies, it came from the merchandising. So again, depending on if they buy toys, if they buy in magazines and whatever else, t shirts and you name it from the solo movie. It could make up for it. Now, again, it's only four days. Now, there's lots of reasons that people don't want to hear. You know, it was Memorial Day weekend, people went away. You know, um, there was other factors that they claim, you know. People are like, eh, it's, it was too early for a Star Wars movie. It's too early. It was only five months in between. So, you know, people are fatigued. That, that's the reason. No, I think it's people who were very upset at Ryan Johnson for The Last Jedi. And I understand that. But I want to say this. It's like punching, someone punches you in the face and you're angry. So you punch somebody else who doesn't deserve it. Why would you want to do that? Why would you want to do that? It's a great movie. And to tell you the truth, I loved it. I thought from the beginning to the end, it was a terrific movie. The characters are terrific. Beckett, Woody Harrelson kicks ass. Donald Glover as Lando is amazing. They are all amazing. I thought the movie was incredible. Now, some people didn't like Ellis, uh, uh, Lando's uh, droid uh, L3. Now, that's fine if you had a little problem with uh, the L3 droid. I couldn't understand that. That's fine. The other problem made it. I had a problem with uh, one of the scenes in the beginning. It bothered me, but not enough to ruin the movie. To me, the movie flowed. It had action. It was fun. It was entertaining. I couldn't believe it was over when it was over. It had the Kessel Run. It uh, showed uh, the card game between Lando and Han Solo. It had a great story. I think all the characters were very interesting. I, I just. I think it was a terrific movie, and I think if you don't go see it, you know, you're gonna miss out on it. And, and I definitely, 
Also, here's the thing. If Ryan Johnson is going to create a trilogy, wouldn't that be the best time to really stick it to him? To, because he's the one who did The Last Jedi. He's the one who everybody was upset at about The Last Jedi. So, why not boycott his trilogy? I mean, I don't even think I have much interest, and I'm a huge Star Wars fan, in going to see the trilogy. But I think Solo, to me, out of the four movies, was right behind Rogue One. I think the standalone movies have been terrific. I think I'm gonna love them. Uh, again, that's just my opinion. And with Kenobi and Boba Fett in a way, yeah, who knows? I mean, I, I think I'm gonna be, it's gonna be really awesome. Even though I'm not that too excited about Kenobi, I think I'm gonna be more excited about Boba Fett. I think it's gonna be more interesting of a movie. But we'll see, you know, time will tell. So if you're new to the channel, uh, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification button to get more Star Wars content in the future. Also, I talk about the Disney parks and everything Star Wars, of course. Feel uh, free to comment. How, how do you feel about this? How, how, how do you feel about the Han Solo? Did you see it? Did you like it? You didn't like it. Why didn't you like it? Why did you like it? Why aren't you going to see it? You know, and that's, you know, just let me know. Um, don't forget to like if you can. Give me a thumbs up. And until next time, this is Robert Dulles for all of us who love Star Wars. I'm the Malina Falcon. Trying to reach Han, Lando, Chewie. Can't get anybody. Uh-oh. I think the troopers are coming. The gig is up. I better get out of here. So until the next time, may the force be with you. Thank you for your, all your following support. Check the description down below. We'll talk next time.